Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Magnus and I welcome you to part 7 of Let's Play Fire Emblem Midnight Sun. We're about to head into chapter 5, Stealth Mission, and this one is a very interesting one. I'm looking forward to this one. That's I think I said like this one three times in a row. Alright, let us go to this town. Ominous waves of dark creatures were suddenly slighted, sighted across the continent. These airy monsters have been summoned by the Demon King who broke the seal. Firetrust managed to control him with her magic, but she won't last long. Luckily, Shiori has a plan to help the vassal in her desperate situation. First of all, the group must reach Seraphiu in the town in Laz La Lazulis. Lazulis is a nation protected by very strict anti-war laws. As such, every Lazulian city is heavily guarded. However, the group doesn't have time to ask for an official pass. They have no choice. They must infiltrate Seraphiu. Alright, so they want to infiltrate the anti-war city. Cool. Chapter 5, Stealth Mission. And yes, this is in fact a stealth mission. And a really fun one at that. Castle Huicada! Your Majesty, your Majesty, the commander has arrived. Understood, let him in. Your Majesty. Please tell me what you know, Sai. The vessel has entered Lasulis. We failed then. We couldn't stop fa the Demon King in time. My apologies. I'll take responsibility. That won't be necessary, Commander. What's the condition of the troops? Corporal Ramov and the Triumvirate's platoons were decimated. When the main army arrived, the Demon King was nowhere to be found. Since we didn't engage her in combat, the condition of the elite soldier is good. However... However? Strange creatures have been sighted around here since yesterday night. They seem to be monsters. Like the ones of the legends. What? If that's true, then... The Demon King could have recovered most of his power already! Soon he'll become stronger than anyone! He'll be unstoppable! What should we do? Send a squad to each village a platoon of the main cities! I won't allow any monstrosity to hurt my people! Never! Your kindness is Hoikata's biggest treasure, your majesty. Leave it to me. Please, Sai. I would be no queen if I didn't care about my people. Anyway, listen carefully. I have new orders for you. Ah, oh, what a fake bitch. Here we are. This place is heavily guarded, just like Shiori said. We're in Lasulis, after all. The law is absolute here. Nobody can enter without an official pass. It won't be easy to sneak in. At least it won't be easy for Hikata to follow us, either. My power would be useful in this kind of situation, but unfortunately I'm not capable of bringing other human beings with me through the dimensions. Don't worry, brother. You've already done a lot for me. I'm sure I'll find the, pe the piece I'm searching for here. I just need to... Ah, uh, Firetrass! It's nothing. I'm fine, really. Yeah, right. You were about to die a moment ago, and are you fine? I'm surprised you can even stand. How can you be so calm? It's because I believe in what Shiori has planned out for me. Moreover, I'm the vassal of the Demon King. It's my duty to control that fiend. I'm the only one who can do it. I can't let anything upset me. A single distraction could be fatal, like before. <laughs> you really are something. Interesting. Interesting? Lady Firetress! The person we're waiting for hasn't arrived yet. It's not a problem, Raya. I'll use this time to make sure everything is ready. Alright, this is the stealth mission. As you can see, we can only bring two people with us. The reason for that is we have to sneak in. I did watch this on Mage Knight's channel. This is an amazingly cool mission. I really like it. Alright, not much to see here. Let's just jump into it. We'll, we'll not bring Helios, but Menmus, obviously a flying unit, would be very useful right now. Alright, uh, yeah. We'll just go. Okay, I'm ready. Now, according to what she already said, I must wait for someone called Schwartz. I wonder what kind of person she... Ah! Alright, of course, you're gonna get at flying units. Long black hair, red eyes, there are no doubts. It's you! Uh, nice to meet you, miss. Miss? The name's Swatch, and I'm a man! What? But you're a Pegasus Knight. So what? Only girls can be Pegasus Knights nowadays? That's sexist! Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to offend you. By the way, is your Pegasus alright? He's totally black. Because my crow is black, maybe? Jeez, not only are you a sexist, but a pony racist. <laughs> pony racist! 
<laughs> Whatever, you're an annoying brat, but the work must be done. Let me explain the details of this mission. Alright, I actually didn't need to bring a flying unit, come to think of it. Our goal is to reach that house. Shiori is waiting for us there. The tavern, okay. Hmm, she should told me she needed some time to prepare something, so she went ahead. How did she get past all of these guys? Yeah, that place is full of weird magic circles and other crazy stuff. Anyway, listen. In this shitty town, there are gods everywhere. If they get us, it's over. Finished. Game over. Got it memorized? Alright, so if we even engage a guard, we're gonna lose. Yes, we have to be careful, but we must hurry, too. I think we can... I think I can control the Demon King for one more hour, then I'll be gone for good. Eh? You don't like look like someone who'll die in the next 60 minutes, trust me! Hey, kids these days are crazy, and sexists, and pony racists! <coughs> anyway, look here. I have observed the guards' behavior from above before, and I'm pretty sure that those fatty guards guarding the gates won't move a single step from there. Be careful, the others will probably follow any suspicious folk dusty. Alright, I understand. Thank you, Swatch. I'm counting on you. Hey, please, no thank you, thank you. It's disgusting. I'm doing this for Shiori, not for you, remember that. Uh, it doesn't change the fact that you're helping someone. I'm going on without you. Hey, wait! Ah, oh, what a guy. Here we go, another boring day. There's nothing as useless as guarding a place who nobody would ever attack or invade. I mean, no one is stupid enough to break our laws, right? <laughs> Alright, so we have a guard right here. Okay, so this is a stealth mission. We have 30 turns to infiltrate. So we need to, uh... We need to get past these guards. The only thing I disagree slightly here with here is the music. The music is way too hectic. This is a stealth mission. The music should be calm, but at the same time, like, tension-filled, you know? Like a Solid Snake mission. Like, the Solid Snake games have amazing music when he sneaks around in the jungle, you know? They're, I don't agree with this music. It kind of ruins the whole stealth mission feeling. So that's, yeah. Okay. So we have Schwartz, a Pegasus Knight. A male Pegasus Knight, even. Claims to have a black Pegasus, but... I don't see the sprite being black. Anyway. What is that? Is that an ice affinity? I don't know. Agile Estoc. Capable of consecutive attacks. Oh, it's a hero sword. Okay. Anyway, let's, uh... So these guys won't move. These guys won't move. Uh, this guy will, however, so I'm gonna need to go around. There we go. We'll bring Menmos. Did I just see a black flying horse? I really should drink less. <laughs> I swear, if I see any suspicious folk, I'll follow them. I'll need a walk. Okay, so now this guy has appeared, but this is a safe spot right here. I'm not actually sure if I need this guy, but I can use him to visit the village, maybe. Okay, so... I can't actually see if there's anything in this vendor. Oh, wow, I can even buy Holy Fire here. Antitoxin, even. But I don't have any money, so... Alright, so... This guy blocks this path. This guy blocks this path. However... I should be able to... Let's see, if I go... Here? I could use this other flying unit that I have to distract the guards. But I think that if they even engage me, then it's over. So I gotta be careful. Alright, so... Okay, what do I want to do right here? Actually, uh, that was a mistake. I was supposed to fly here and then continue flying this way. Alright. I'll do that then. So this is a safe spot. However, I can go and visit the house next turn. Okay. So this guy, that means that... Okay, this right here is a safe spot, I think. No, it's not, actually. Okay. That's strange. Hmm. Let's see, how should I do this? This is not a safe spot. What? How about this spot right here then, no? Really? Huh? This is weird, I don't quite get this. Uh, I can't go there because these guys will attack me and that's game over. I can't attack- well, maybe I need to visit this house then. Oh my, who are you? How did you get in? 
I'm scared, mommy help! What? Who are you? How dare you make my child cry? Get out of here now! I'm scared! Ah, that's gonna alert the guard, of course. Did you hear that? Someone was screaming. I'm going to check on the situation. You take my place here. Roger. And that guy is, of course, standing... Slightly... Yeah, so that means that we now have a safe spot. Right here. Wait a minute, these guys have bows? Oh... However, it means... Now, this is the safe spot right here. At least I think it is. Yeah, those guys won't move. So now we have the safe spot right there. So I'm loving this mission already. Okay, so we'll move over here. It's nice to have two flying units on this mission, I feel. Okay, so where should we fly next? Uh, we need to fly... We can fly over... We need to visit this house. I'm pretty sure we need to do that. We don't have all the time in the world, so we gotta be a little bit careful. Alright, so if we visit this house, can we get out of here? We should be able to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I should be able to. No, wait, movement of seven. Okay, that's bad. Uh, will we be able to get back? Uh, I'm actually not sure. We could just get up here, I suppose. Yeah, we could go visit this house, see if there's anything interesting there. Who the hell are you? Guards! An intruder in here, quick! What? An intruder! Soldiers, don't let him escape! Intensify the guard! Whoever breaks Lalu's law. What? They got us. It's over. We won't make it in time any- What? I'm sorry, that's stupid. That's stupid. Come on, really? How was I supposed to know that? Okay. So I guess this mission is a little bit trial and error. What's... Oh, the game froze. Yeah, this happens sometimes. It happened with uh, Mage Knight's hack as well when I played that. When you restart, sometimes the map freezes, so you just have to reset and restart. Okay, well, since this map is very trial and error-ish, I, I guess using save states to find out stuff like that is, like, it's... Everything else would just be a gigantic waste of my time, really. But I don't like things like that. I mean, really, a house that just makes the g game stop? I... That's just silly, in my opinion. Anyway, we know what to do right now. So let's try that again. Okay, the guards are gonna come. Still, though, I like the map. It, it's something different. Just do something about that awful music, please. Okay, uh, now we can go up there. And... We'll enter the safe spots. Talk to the... Wait a minute. We'll move up here first. Visit this house. That's gonna cause the guard to move. Which means that this will be a safe spot. And then I can move up here. Well, if the game's gonna do that to me, then I might as well use the save state to figure out if, if this house is uh, gonna arrest me or not. Because honestly, I mean, it's stupid. Like, it, it kind of encourages the save state, which I don't like. Crap, this is bad. What exactly was I thinking when I stole this thing? Hmm. Hey, you, get over. You over there. Yes, do you need something? Take this. It's a gift. Bye. What the fuck? What? A ruby, alright. Shh, that thief! I won't sleep until I find him. Alright, so that's gonna... That's gonna... Oh, crap. Okay, so you can get a ruby. But that aggro's the guard. And now also I'm gonna get attacked. Stop right there! Who are you? Will that make the game? An intruder! Soldiers, don't let him escape! Intensify... Yeah, okay, so that... That, um... That uh, means game over. Okay, so if I want that ruby, I will aggro a soldier. So it's basically make the game harder. Okay. Alright, then let's move over here, I suppose. Okay, I managed to get to the higher part of the town. Now to get to that house. And now a guard appears. Man, that was a good meal. Now I feel like I could stand and watch forever. Okay, so that guy won't move. 
Tch, that damn woman. I can't understand her anymore. Oh, and I have to also... And I also have to guard this god-awful place. This isn't my lucky day indeed. I think I'll have a walk to clear my head a little. Okay, so he's gonna move around. Hmm, that soldier on the left, he's probably going to move. If only there was a way to get rid of him quickly. Maybe some of the people inside these houses could help us. That one, for example. No, wait, that one is odd. I can hear someone screaming. Perhaps it's not a good idea to go there. Okay, okay. So, it, the game does warn you not to go in that house. Perhaps. Yeah, the game does warn you. That's good, but it didn't warn me quickly enough. Okay, so that soldier is gonna move. I need to get out of his... Uh... So, not that house, but there are two houses. Okay, I'm gonna have to go away now. Let's see. He has a movement of five, so one, two, three, four, five. This should be a safe zone. He's moving like that, that's fine then. Okay, but not this house. Alright, I only have 20 more turn. Oh, crap, okay. Hey, I forgot to say something important. Alright, I forgot to give him his voice. The house we're trying to reach? I can't go there with you. Up there, everyone would notice a black pegasus with a girl and a man on it. We have to find a way to drop you near the house without anyone noticing. And reach the house and seize it, okay? Alright, he's basically telling you he can't seize it. Okay, I assume we're gonna have to check this house then. Oh, where did that moron go? Hey, you there, wait, come here for a moment. Do you need something, my lady? Have you possibly seen a soldier with a big nose and a beard out there? Mm, yes, he was wandering around. That awful man! Leaving me alone like this with the excuse of a job which isn't needed by anyone! Ha! As if there were any intruders here in Seraphew! Ridiculous, isn't it? Ha! Ha! Yes, ridiculous. Right? He's going to hear words from me! Hey, you stupid moron! Can you hear me? You're going to pay if you don't come home immediately! Oh, that was my wife, and she wants me at home. Like hell I'm going there. But she'll hold me back by force if I stay here. Ha! Huh, maybe I should go to the new pub on the other side of the town. <laughs> okay, that's a lot of fun. <coughs> Blah. That's actually a lot of fun. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. I think I managed to remove my microphone before I sneezed. Alright, I'll make a safe step and go into this house then. I'm so hungry! Uh, okay. That was kind of stupid. Okay, um... There's a house over here. I guess I could go check that out. Oh, crap! Yeah, that's... Uh, and yes, I am, I am using save states on this chapter because it is a trial and error map, really. I mean, I'm not gonna restart every time I do something silly. Okay, uh... There we go. Okay, so there's no point in visiting that house. And also, that soldier comes near me if anything happens. So... I need to get past him somehow. I don't think this guy moves. At least, it doesn't appear like these armor knights move. Alright, this guy moves. Okay. Great. Wow, that's a really cool animation right there. Holy crap. Okay, so this guy moves. The game could have told me that, but okay. Anyway, it shouldn't be too hard. I see a safe zone right here. This guy has a longbow. Okay, that's sneaky. Uh, I might... What happens if I go visit this house right here? This is the safe zone. So if I go visit this house, what will happen then? Excuse me, I found this axe here. You are one of the soldiers, right? You should give it back to whichever of your friends dropped it. Don't even think about keeping it for yourself. Okay. Oh, wait, that caused me to lose the game, didn't it? Yeah, because now that guy's gonna attack me. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can find the safe zone. Should be one right here. Yeah. Right here, there's a safe zone. I think I need to go and talk to some of the... Uh, in fact, I think I want to leave... I, w I really want the ruby, so I'm actually going to leave this other guy here. Alright, I think I can go visit that village. Unless I get arrested again, of course. 
Welcome, it's your lucky day. Since you're our millionth customer, we'll give you two free croissants. Please share the joy of eating our products with someone. Enjoy the taste of the famous Seraphue Bakery. See you again. Okay. Did that even make something happen? Alright, I guess I better see what happens when you visit this house. Take this, it's a special weapon. Ask no questions. If you can take it out of here safely, you can keep it. Napalm shots? Wait a minute. Oh, okay, okay, I get it. So that... Yeah, I see. Um, if I If I go from here, I might be able to get it. This guy can reach every single one of these things. What? Like, see, if I do this... I should be able to go up again. Like, right here. And that's... Yeah, that's a safe zone. Okay, I got the napalm shot. Let's see, an arrow that explodes on contact. That's probably gonna be nice on my royal archer. But how am I to solve this uh, thing, then? That's a little bit weird. There's no safe zones here. Um, that's weird. Huh. Okay, nothing's happening, apparently. He said he could stand watch forever. That's not a good thing, right? How about if I just drop her off here? Will that help? Now, that's gonna make the game over. Okay, that's... Hmm, how am I supposed to make this work? This will get me arrested, right? Yeah, this will get me arrested. Uh, I feel like, is this guard... I haven't been into this armory. Do they sell hair? Just steal weapons. Alright, then. That's really weird. I don't quite get this. What what am I missing right here? Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! I know now! I just got some croissants! So I should probably go talk to the guy in that house who was hungry. Yeah, sure, that has to be it. They wouldn't include shit like that just to fuck with me, right? It has to be. Okay. I'm hungry. Hmm. Hey, kid, do you want this? Oh my, it's the cookery croissant I wanted so badly. Thank you very much. I'm so happy. Daddy, can you hear me? I'm so happy. Oh, I can hear my kid's voice. I guess he's having fun. Oh, and that caused him to move. Puh. Ha, ha. Finally, that soldier left his guard down, and I could pass. This is my secret place. No one will ever find me here. I can finally... Eat my burger, and I won't forgive anyone who tries to ruin this little moment of pleasure. I'll follow him to this grave and make my burgers with his meat. Aw, oh, come on, really? Okay, so how many turns do we have left? Nine turns? Shouldn't be too hard. We have to sneak past this guy now. So I hope I have enough turns left to do that. Let's see. Uh... So, does the game end if we attack him? Or does he just... What the fuck? Okay, that, yeah, so the game does end if we try to do that, so we need to sneak around him somehow. But that's not hard. We should have enough turns to win this, or just gotta be careful of that guy. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is, uh... <laughs> Is this a safe zone? I think it is. Oh, oh crap. <laughs> yeah, this is a safe zone. Okay, cool. I get it. And now I can fly around. Ugh, my time is almost up. Come on, we can't give up now. That's fine, because now I can drop fire trust off. There's a safe spot here when I can drop her off. Right. Oh, wait a minute. There was... Oh. There was a very nice axe I could have gotten. But if I want to get that axe... 
I think I want the axe over the ruby, to be quite honest. Yeah, I definitely want the axe over the ruby. Ruby is nice, but that axe seemed a lot better, so I'm gonna go get that. Okay. Okay, so I'm, I can't run into this guy, that's for sure. So I need to go around him. Then I need to send Manmus up like here. And that way I can go and get the axe right before... Right before fire to centers. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Oh, thanks. I'm an idiot. I'm being a little bit sloppy now since I'm using save states, but I really feel like it's justified on this chapter because... My god, so... I mean... <laughs> so much trial and error on this chapter, but still. I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay, so not right next to the wall because this guy has a javelin, note to self. But if I do this, I should be able to get him. Okay. So, right here. And next turn, we're gonna go and get the axe. There we go. Agile Axe. Is that a hero axe? Yeah, it is a hero axe. So I think that was worth it. Okay. Fucking awesome. This was a very good chapter. Holy crap. I made it. Excellent. Very well done. This is one of the best chapters I've ever played in any Fire Emblem hack ever. Hello? Is anyone there? Shiori, it's me. Uh, 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 no, no, no. I must... Control him at any cost. Kepana now. Well, who? I didn't even catch that name. Huh? Huh? My strength is coming back. Did it work, Shiori? Hi there, Firetrust. Oh, hello there. Oh my God. Cuteness overload. So many beautiful girls in this picture. Holy crap! It was a success, Vassal. And who is this kid? Kid? Huh? <laughs> this is Kepana. She's a friend of mine, and the world's greatest healer. Oh, I knew it had to be a cleric. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love cute clerics. Also, don't be fooled by her looks. She's 25. <laughs> 25? You're older than me, then. My, apologize, miss My apologies, Miss Kepana. You look so young. It's okay, Lady Firetress. It's not the first time someone has mistaken me for a child. I'm pleased to make your acquaintance anyway. The pleasure is mine. May I ask how that spell worked? Of course, see this magic circle on the ground? We've been storing magical power in it for several years. The amount of magic can amplify someone's inner strength for some time. It worked as I'd hoped. I'm glad we made it in time. Hehe. <laughs> Thanks for everything. But still, this isn't enough. It's all in your hands now. Leave it to us. Yeah, but you must sleep now. Like I told you before, your body needs one day, full day of rest for this magic. To be totally effective. There's a bed in the other room. Feel free to have a nap. Ah, that's not a bad idea. I feel like I could sleep for days. Oh gods, she collapsed. Well, it's understandable. You went through a lot, Fire Trust. Now, now, come on. On my back. I won't let you sleep on the floor. <laughs> the other knights. Does that mean that... What? The other knights? Oh, this is like a flashback? I won't allow it. Huh? It's not time to, to give up yet. I won't let you die, Firetress. Thanks, Shiori, but I've already told you. It's too late to save me. The Demon King has awakened, and I'm restraining him only with my magic now. Without the seal, the vassal's power isn't enough to control him. He'll overcome me soon, and I... No, there must be a way. In the middle of Lasulis, five dis days distance from here, there's a place known as the Midnight Shrine. The Midnight Shrine? I've heard of it. It's the place where the soul of the Demon King was transferred from the Sacred Stone of Pylum to the first vassal through the vassalage, vassalage ceremony. Right, if we perform a vassalage, we could redo, redo your seal. Impossible. We can't get there in time. He's right. Do you forget? I only have one or two more days. I know, and I have a solution for that too. There's a friend of mine, Seraphiu, who'll amplify your magical energy. It's a temporary solution, but you'll be able to control him for the time being. Is that even possible? 
Yes, you'll need, need to rest for some time after the process, though. Moreover, it takes some time for the vassalage to be prepared as well. But since the seal of the Demon King is broken, we don't have time to waste. I'll leave for the Midnight Shrine in order to prepare the ceremony for you. That way, when you arrive, you'll be able to perform the ritual right away. Just reach me at the Shrine. Everything will be ready. You can trust me. So why couldn't we have seen this before the map? Is it because the emulator is, like, I don't have that much experience with room hacking, but I do know that you change current events in the game, so perhaps because the original story had a night sequence in it right now, it made more sense to have it as a flashback right here, instead of trying to hack in the night sequence before the map. That is something I that might be the reason why this was a flashback, but it felt really weird from a story perspective that, like, you know, you go forward with the story and then suddenly you're like, and the reason why we're doing this is because... It's not something that bothers me a great deal, though. But still, this map deserves so much praise uh, because I've never seen anything like it before. And I'm not sure if any other hacks have done something like this, but this is amazing. Like, patrolling guards. Like, the only thing that comes close um, is Fire Emblem 5. Uh, when, the, like, the map where you encounter Galsus for the first time, where you try to escape a town, there are patrolling guards that go back and forth, and you can visit certain houses, but if you aggro the guards, uh, they'll spawn a whole bunch of reinforcements and come attack you. That's the only thing I can really think about that comes close in any other Fire Emblem game, but this hack did, did it really well. It's like a puzzle, uh, and it also gives you hints. I mean, my bad for entering that village before getting the hint to. That was a little bit stupid of me, but still. I like this map. Great map. And the story is coming along really nicely. And now we have a sexy cleric! Yeah! She didn't look like a child. She looked cute. Alright. <laughs> My name is Ben Mangus. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.